morning guys uh i think it's december 3rd or 4th i don't know but anyhow i'm still trying to do these slats okay i already laid the ones that are going on the bottom shelf in the cabinet over there i haven't gotten them spaced perfectly but now since jeremy trimmed these up for me it's going to be a lot easier to get the spacing done so uh okay this will be going here right there I guess I don't I don't know I'm gonna stick it right there for now I've done a lot of things so far I did all the beadboard and everything in the house but this right here is is uh, posing to be the most difficult probably because it takes measuring and <laughs> more measuring and stuff. I'm not sure where I want it. I think in the middle here, like this side. So I'll have to take a hammer and hammer them in because that hurts my fingers. Put this one in. I put the other two in already. I ain't playing no more, y'all. I am not playing games no more. Yep. <sighs> okay, it's glued on. Let me wipe the excess off. I am about to add some glue to the second one. Get it where I want it, okay? Add some glue. Oops, I just dropped my clamps. Add a clamp to it. And then once I get that on there, I can lift this out and uh, carry it over and start putting them all up. I've got to figure out the spacing, though. I've got to measure now since they're all pretty close to the same size. Mm -hmm. This side's going to be out big time. Okay. That works. Oop, that's out real bad. Mm -hmm. Let me just clamp it so I can try to get it out of here. At least I know kind of where it needs to go. I'm going to clamp this side down. And I'll get this sucker out of here. Okay. Uh, Alright, let's get this out of here. I'm almost scared to do this. Oh, okay. That was easy. Oh, look at that, y'all. <laughs> Got it. Um, hmm, where am I going to do this at? I guess I need to do it right here. Let me lay this on the ground. <sighs> Y'all, Jeremy's been buying these little, I think they're a dollar and you get five <laughs> Reese's. Anyway, it's not even like a whole candy bar. Well, it's probably equivalent to one normal size one because they're like this small. Anyway, I ate a package last night while I was watching YouTube in bed and <laughs> going to sleep. I had a sweet tooth bad. Anyway, this morning I, went, I was like, oh crap, on my dresser, because I didn't wad them up. I just threw them over as I ate them on my nightstand. <laughs> Looked like a freaking Reese's junkie this morning. It was hilarious. Okay. I could actually eat that one right now. Those are his. He had two left. But he got, I gave him two of these uh, the other day from one package he bought me, and he's got Kit Kats. Man, these things are so good. Okay, let's see if this fits. Oh, me. Yes, it does. All right. Uh, all right, then. Let's go from here, I guess. Let me fix the camera. <laughs> Ooh, that's scary. I only have two clamps. It's not a big deal as long as I screw them in. Hey, you know what I can do? Okay, I'll get this one set and then pre-drill, screw it in from the bottom. I was about to ask y'all, I don't know why I ask y'all questions like y'all can tell me. How can I have glue last night before I went to bed and cannot find it anywhere this morning? I, I searched. Five minutes, found it. Golly. It's my dang washing machine. I got so much crap on it. Oh, man. Is this the right idea? Is this what I should be doing? Y'all, I just put this measure on it, and uh, I had to move this down like a tiny, tiny bit. Then that one popped up, added more glue, 
put it back where it was and I mean it is like exact it's exact so I'm gonna flip this here shortly I'm gonna give it a few more minutes man this stuff dries fast because I couldn't hardly get that off that is crazy I mean I just did it it hadn't been five minutes since I filmed this last one hold on I keep thinking I keep thinking of things to say after I get this built I could just put it down on the ground I mean, on the bottom shelf, couldn't I? Just drop it down the bottom, and then I can put the other ones exactly where these are. Unless I'm way off. But if I'm way off, that's it's going to be screwed up. If if I'm way off and it looks bad, I'm going to have Jeremy build, build them for me, because he's a really good builder. Oh, got to find out what's going on outside. Okay, I'm not so worried about these since I took it off. I'm not so worried about these. Uh, clamps now because I mean they are on here good so let me get that off of there before it dries too good all right I figured it out but I'm gonna mark it so I don't have to go through this again because this was hard Now I know where to put the glue and where this is going to go because it doesn't have to be perfect. So I'm going for it, y'all. Y'all seeing this? <laughs> I'm going for it. And I just got to make sure that this is in here good, even with this back part. And then this goes right here. I'm going to take these off now that they've had time to sit. I'm still in there good. Yeah, perfect. Okay. Put this one on. It's still on there good. That looks pretty good, doesn't it? Now I just hope it fits. I hope it fits. Hmm. Man, this is nerve wracking. Because, I mean, I don't know if it's right. Hmm. I tell y'all a story. One time, I was getting frustrated. I was outside working on that deck. Uh, not the deck, but the skirting that I put on with the metal. And I said, Lord Jesus, help me. You know how I do. <laughs> and uh, I sat down and said, Jesus, help me. He goes, he told me to do something. Oh, I heard it clear as day. Put this here, cut it out, and blah, 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 blah. And I said, oh, okay. And I go, how did you know that? And he goes, because I'm, I'm the master carpenter. I heard that clear as day. See, that's when you start living for Jesus, you start hearing from him. He says, my children will know my voice. And you know what? It worked out perfect. I said, oh my gosh, how did you do that? And that's when he said, because I'm the master carpenter. And I was like, oh, you are. That's right. <laughs> so every time I do a project, I call on Jesus when it comes to wood. It always works out. So, <laughs> Okay, now that I've done this, I can start pre-drilling right in the middle here. Here and here. All six of them. And get some nails in there. Let's do this one. Oh, yeah. Okay. I keep checking to make sure it didn't go through. <laughs> that would stink. Um, let's see. I'm missing screws. I got this old rusty one. And... Where'd the one go that was, I said was all warped? I must have used it. I'm still missing one. That don't make sense. I thought I had six. Oh, I did have six. I need seven because I wasn't thinking about this side one. <laughs> Alright, let's put in the old rusted one. I hate using an old rusted one. Really, honestly. But. Okay. 
works just as good. I ain't going nowhere. All right, I gotta turn off the camera and find two more screws. Oh my gosh. Oh, I need to uh, glue that piece on too, and then that's gonna have to be pre-drilled. All right, let's see. I gotta get this out of here. Please work. Please work, please work, please work, please work. Oh, Lord, please work. Okay. Oh, gosh. Oh, no. You guys. I did it wrong. No, I didn't. Oh, okay. golly, that just scared the crap out of me. I was thinking I did it backwards. I didn't. Okay. Haha. <laughs> It works. Yes, Lord. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, Lord. That looks really good, too, y'all. Okay. I've got to screw. Oh, I did screw that in. Okay. Y'all, I tell you what, I'm losing it. Okay, so these are all screwed in, and they and it comes in and out. So now I can adjust it. But, and it's not fixed. I was going to fill these in with hole filler, but actually, I don't need to do that. And when I paint them, it's not gonna, they're not going to look as dark. So I'm going to paint the insides gray, too, so it's not going to be. It'll be more camouflage than it is now. It looks like crap right now. Look at this. I see. I mean, that box there. Look at that crap. It's so cheap. Mobile home for you. And this is a good brand mobile home. This is a Horton. It's supposed to be up there with a uh, Palm Harbor and stuff. Huh. Anyway, that'll be more ca camouflage whenever I get it painted gray but yeah it's very very tacky look at that oh i'll fill all that in with caulk it'll be amazing yeah well this side not that side that side's gonna be covered up with a that's not staying just like it is buddy it's gonna get uh contact paper on the shelf that's it Let's see here since this is up i'm gonna put that there and uh let's see how this looks over here See, you can't even see the other side. I was worried about this side being skinnier. <laughs> you can't even see the other side. You can't even tell because of that box. This is amazing. Yeah. One and a half exact. Yes. Okay. That was a weird dance. <laughs> Until I'm getting old and I do the weird dances. Y'all know what weird dances I'm talking about. Does the old people dance? I'm doing it. Oh gosh, I've resorted to the old people dancing. This kind of stuff. Yeah. I'm officially old now. Alright, I'm going to wait for this to dry for like five minutes. Take them off. Do my pre-drill. Screw it on. Go to the next which would be this one. I don't feel any glue. Okay, cool. Take that off. I don't even know if I'm recording this. I hope I am. Oh, backwards. It was in the wrong spot anyhow, so let's see. Don't move it. Can y'all believe I did that? Y'all know what I did, right? I went right through the top. Instead of going upside down. Behind it. Now I'm going to have to... Oh, yeah, I'm so crazy. I can't... Now I'm going to have to just fill it with wood putty. It's not that big of a deal, but that was a stupid, stupid mistake. Stupid mistake. Y'all... I'm pretty honest, or I would not show you that, but I did it. I did it. Sure did. Okay, at least it took. I didn't screw up too bad, y'all. Can't do that again. That was stupid. I just got finished. It is 434. I didn't drill anymore. 
through there, so I've only got one. I gotta redo. Let's see. Now, I ended up taking one board out because as I kept going, it got wider and wider. And when I added that extra board, it was too much of a difference. But I think that looks really good. Let's go to the other side. Yes, now I just got to do the bottom. where these hit so I can draw a line and cut it. Whoops, I need to mark it right here and cut it. Draw a straight line and then cut it down because that lip is getting in the way. It can't have a lip. It needs to be flush. Look, I got two of them here. Two here. Two here. What the heck? Hey, you guys. Uh, I'm over this kitchen. I'm trying to download a uh, video right now. And now I know I remember now. Because I thought, why aren't I doing my videos in HD? You know? Because I started at, at 930. It's now 1130. And it's only 32%. So, and remember whenever I use, uh, when Jeremy comes home, he won't be able to get online. I can't watch YouTube. I've got it on regular TV right now, so... Anyhow, I'll probably end up deleting it and reproducing it as a regular until I get a better setup. Anyhow, like I said, I'm over this. I'm going to go ahead and draw these lines out with the square because I've already marked them. And then after that, we're going to do something different. I don't know if you'd be interested. It's my aquarium canopy I built. It doesn't fit right. I've got to do some cutting on it. And I'm cleaning up my bedroom. I already put it on here. But, um, yes, I'm over it today. I am. Well, that's going to look good. Yeah. Then I'm not going to do this one. Mm -hmm. Go down here and do it, I guess. I don't even know why I'm videotaping that, but this, this is stupid. I don't even videotape this. I don't even know if I'm into this. Here's the deal with this. Uh, this top this is the cutout for the aquarium filter and it's getting stuck and it's pulling the lid off so i've got to cut another half inch off here and a half inch off here i have a nail here and i have a nail here it only needs to go down this far because that's where it rests on the top of the aquarium got a nail here so i don't have the half inch i thought i can cut that down and then this part and that's all i've got I mean, anything might help unless I just go ahead and cut this completely off. I got a nail there to keep that on. I don't think that'll be a problem. Hmm. I'm going to go down. All right. Ugh. I'm going to go across. Oh, gosh. Wish me luck. Put on my safety eyeglasses. <laughs> I cut through a nail I'm not sure that worked pretty good all right oh this is the one that's scary okay here we go wow that gave me a lot more space yeah I cut right through a nail huh can't believe that I did sure did all right, I'm going to go ahead and trim this off since that wasn't as bad as I thought it was going to be. All right, I 
figured if I don't go ahead and try to do it now, it's going to be more of a pain in the butt to come out here later and have to get this jigsaw back out. The only thing that scares me is how crooked this is now. It actually looks good. It's just kind of spooky. Look. Really not good. Oh, y'all. Here we go. It's lumpy, but I can sand it down. I can sand it down, plus it's going to have glue under it so I can level it. Oh, man. Smells like crap. Hey, at least I got two more. Remember that I was going to put some on the other side? I need a better job now. I don't know. <laughs> All right, it fit back in there, but I'm definitely going to have to cut some of those slats straighter. So that's going to be another day. I'm done with the jigsaw. Let's go see if this aquarium canopy, feel, uh, canopy fits now. Was Gunner actually a sick kid? According to Lacey, he was a very sick kid. Uh, All right, when I was coming in here, this is pulling up. See that? The whole thing's cracked now. I cut through a screw, I guess. I'm going to come in through the back, like over here. I don't know if you can see it or not. Put a screw going into this. going to have to. Right here. Oh, man, I must be hitting a freaking nail. Can you believe that? Of all the places in this thing, I could... I'm probably hitting that screw, so I'm going to have to go up. Let's see. Okay. It's in there. Okay. It didn't come through, and it's tight now. That was the problem. I really should clean. Oh, let's see how bad is it. It's probably bad. I better clean it. I gotta clean it because if I put this canopy on it and then put the decorations on top and it's dirty, I'm gonna have to take it all off and clean it. Let me clean it real quick and then we'll see if it fits. <laughs> Well, I cleaned it, but I made a disaster out of my tank, but <laughs> it'll clear up shortly. What I do is I've got a bad habit of grabbing them, the filters out themselves, and it's got a basket to where you can lift it up. That's what I should do, but I start pulling them out, and then all the stuff comes off the top of, out the filter, messes it up. So, let's see how this looks, if it works. Oh, please work. Oh gosh, mm. it's not easy. Well, I'll tell you right now, it goes on better. Whoa. Oh wow, huge difference, huh? I don't really decorate it. It's just some things that I set up on top. <laughs> I got this old driftwood. I bought this uh, for like a. I want to say a dollar or something like that. Isn't it beautiful? It's driftwood. And I boiled it and boiled it and boiled it because to, to put it in aquariums, I wanted it in my aquarium. Uh, tannins come out of it and stuff, but it was bubbling. And I think what happened, I think it had varnish on it. So there was no way I could stick this in my aquarium. I'd kill all my fish. So now I just stick it up here on top. It's pretty. Unless you're tall, you can't really see this stuff anyway which is fun. I've got a little bottle. Oh, here it is. Bottle, and then I have a picture. This water will clear up real good shortly. Oh, I can't do that. That's got a piece of off of it.
picture somewhere. You just gotta try to clean. I mean, I've got so much crap. I just gotta try to find places for the crap, you know? <laughs> I found a baby. There he is back there. That's, that's not a baby. That's a five-month-old Corridorus. He's been in hiding. So, there's a baby. It's still a mess. There's the big mama. They get really big. But I just love him. Oh, he took off. He'll be out swimming around before long. I'm surprised he hasn't yet. Yeah, I made a mess out of this. <laughs> It'll clear up. All those little things floating around will be gone shortly. I did that when I yanked them, I yanked those uh, filters out. 